Do they everybody. polish it every single day? I was wondering. Do they, right? do they? Do they? How often do they polish the beans here? Oh, I don't. I don't know. I have to ask the polisher. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. Um, Hopefully, often <laughs> people polish. are like fogging it up and <clears throat> with all their selfies. And yeah, right. Craziness. Can um, you guys introduce yourselves first? So we yeah, sure. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I am Ian Castleman. Okay. Hi, I'm Matthew Webb. My name is Mike Gailey. I'm Josh Ramsey. Okay, perfect. And this is our audience right now. And the name of your uh, band is Mariana's <laughs> Trench. Mariana's Trench. Yeah. Wow. What so I've been calling it Mariana's Trench this whole time. That's okay. Uh, you know what Americans do? Is it an American yeah. name? I think it it's is. It's not just Americans, is it? I feel more so here than at home. Huh. Well, I appreciate you saying We that don't really care. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me feel better, so thanks. Um, so I, I was saying a couple minutes ago, before we even put the camera on, um, that I just discovered you guys a couple of months ago. And I work for The Mix here in town. And I like fell in love with your, uh, is it your second, maybe third record? I don't know, the one with Fallout on it. Yep. It's like, freaking amazing. And I've been like pushing it so hard. And then your record people sent me your singular, single uh, Glimmer, and they're actually going to play it on the mix, and I'm so excited. Yeah, that's, oh, yeah, that's exciting. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. It is. It feels, it feels like a huge victory for me. I'm like, yes, we did it. So, Thank you. Yes, you're very much. Are you kidding me? Thank you. That's awesome. Okay, group hug. Uh, where are you guys? Are you all from Canada? Yep. We're uh, uh, Vancouver. From Vancouver. Vancouver. Yeah. 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 Other, cool. other side of the country. Got it. From where we are. Yes. So, and you guys had the day off. You spent the day in Chicago yesterday. Yes, it was warm and sunny, and I ate at at least seven different restaurants. <laughs> <laughs> so many restaurants. We yeah. kind of expect everybody to gain weight while they're in town. Yeah. Right. So you're I did, I avoided did the anyone, pizza. Did, yeah. Did anyone do deep? I did it. I went. I, I went straight to uh, what's it called? Your. No, Giordano's. Giordano's. Yeah, okay. and and had the deep dish. Waited the full hour for the pizza to show up. And uh, I, I got through with a bunch of buddies, and it was, uh, I had to take a nap afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> it was, it was, I feel like Bruce is a lot of bread. Yeah. 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 It was fantastic, though. I had a, had a great time. Then we walked, uh, did a little river walk, and sat and had a beer on the water there. It was like, it was awesome. It was so nice. Yeah. It's, it's just the universe, maybe, like, or the stars aligning that you guys were here on the one nice day that we've had in the past, like, two months, because it's been <laughs> rainy and crappy for, like, ever. So I'm really glad that worked out for you. Yeah, <laughs> the last time we were here was just very cold, so it was nice to get that so you could really explore yeah. without having to bundle up. We need to get you guys back here, like, summertime, like, Lollapalooza. Oh, man, we would love to do that, yeah. I mean, yeah. we got to make some calls, gentlemen. Oh, yes. <laughs> we do. What's the street? We are not going to stop. We have a street festival. Taste of Lincoln. Taste of Lincoln. Yeah. Oh, okay. I heard some fans that you guys were there. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, and that was a, that was a really nice day. Yeah, Jerry, nice. you know the Street Fest people. Make it happen. I know. Okay, we'll, see. we'll talk to you. We'll make some calls. <laughs> uh, so we're talking about, you guys are talking about all the food that you mm. ate in town. Although I've seen on your Instagram, uh, Josh, are you like making like beef wellington and all this? Are you I like, cook, yeah. so that's just a hobby or that's like your, your side love? Like, what's the deal? Yeah, it's just a, it's a you know what, you know what it is? Um, I really like to do creative things. Okay. And um, whereas writing an album might be a year of my life. And an afternoon in the kitchen, you're going to be done at the end of the day. You know okay. what I mean? I, I look at, it's sort of like a, a much faster creative outlet, I think. Okay. Do you clean up afterwards as well? I do, yeah. Amazing. <laughs> <That's a keeper. laughs> right. <laughs> right. That's what we're looking for. Uh-huh. Um, so talking about the new album, it's Phantoms, right? That's, yes. That's the latest. And it's about past loves being haunted by past, a past love, right? So I was wondering what your favorite movie is. Is it a horror or romance? Oh, dear. Uh, I thought you were going to ask what our favorite past love was. Oh, uh, well, I don't want to. We don't want to hear about that. Too many people. Okay. No names, no names. No names. There's no remain anonymous. Maybe it's just, can I be suspense? Or do I have yeah. to choose horror? No. Like, I love, the like, it was a, you know, kind of haunted movie, The Others. Have you seen that one with Nicole Kidman? Of course. That was a fantastic movie. Oh, yeah. The, the twist at the end I thought was great. We actually uh, borrowed a little bit from that movie in our new video, actually. Okay. <laughs> what? The mirror thing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Nice. Oh, okay. Anyone else? I can't. I can't handle horror movies. I'm too scared to, to turn the sound off and just <laughs> and close my eyes. Yeah. I, I. I like lights. What about romance? What's your favorite? Yeah. Romance. Yeah. Now we're talking. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what's my favorite romance movie? What's that one that everybody watches at Christmas with Hugh Grant? Not in, oh, a, no, no, uh, Love Actually. That's a great movie. That's a great movie. Yeah, that's a, great movie. that's a good one. 
Yeah. I'm gonna help you the next time someone asks you about your favorite love story. Just throw throw the movie True Romance at them. Uh, okay. I mean, it's oh, a great a, love yeah, story. It's a, it's a, it is good. What does it say? <laughs> Better to have a gun than not need one, than not have a gun and need one. I, I mean, think that quotes some, from that movie. Something yeah. like that, yeah. <laughs> it's pretty violent. <violated. laughs> I think my favorite horror movie is um, Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants Part 2. Terrifying. <laughs> oh, God. Terrifying. Oh, that one. Oh, that one. Vicious. For- <laughs> Vicious. Was, was America even on that? Wasn't she on the first one or something? Oh, was, I don't know. I haven't even? actually seen them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> has there even been a part two? Did you make that up? I think there is. <laughs> oh, God. I think there actually is. Who shares pants? Do you guys share clothes on tour? <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> Although we have a lot of similar outfits. Like, mm. as in the exact same outfit. Because there's only so many stores that sell, like, the rock and roll clothing. Right. You know? So, or so many websites. So you end up, like, ordering the same thing. As <laughs> Mike and I have the same jacket. Josh and Mike have the same pants. <laughs> <laughs> and we really do have to coordinate before we go on stage. That's it's a great cool. look, though. You guys have good style. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Does somebody trying to, like, consult on what you guys should wear, or do you guys just do your own thing? Uh, do your own thing. Yeah, do your own thing. Okay. Um, uh, oh, you guys beat Ariana Grande, I heard, on the charts. Oh, hey. So, somebody get <laughs> one of those long ponies as well as they can do the style. Oh, <laughs> so much, so much money behind all those singles, it was great. <laughs> <laughs> it was like your family, your grandma. Yeah. Everybody. <laughs> nice. She actually has extensions. Ariana? <laughs> that, honey, you know that pony is not real. <laughs> Gee, thanks, just bought it. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> um... Who Do You Love was filmed on kind of like a budget, but it was really interesting. Where was that filmed at? And That's that was Vancouver. Over, yeah, all over all Vancouver. Vancouver. Okay. At the pet store. It's not the pets. Yeah, the pet store <laughs> and the SPCA and, and just in the parks and stuff like that. Okay. Yeah, we took we took our budget and just kind of used it to do nice, nice. things. Thanks. Nice. Yeah. And, uh, Canucks Place? Is that... Or was it the... McDonald's. McDonald's. Yeah, it's like a children's yeah. hospital kind of thing. Oh, oh we have that here. They're, at, they're actually amazing. Yeah. So they, amazing. They, they, yeah, amazing. they like took care of my little cousin and my, and my aunt and uncle's family. Like, they were, you know, when she was sick. And yeah. it was... They were... They're such a good organization. They're so good. Yeah. And you're in there and, like, uh, you know, families are going through such difficult things to be in that place. And right. It feels happy in there. It's amazing. Like it still feels like a happy vibe. Right, there. and it's, they're help, they're just like taking care of stuff. It's very inspiring to right. see. You don't yeah. even want to think about yeah, when, when that's happening. It's, it's beautiful. Wow, yeah. oh, you just had a moment. I love I it. Thank you. Okay. Good talking points. <laughs> yes. Um, so, have you guys ever been to Mariana's Trench? Yes. No, but here? James Cameron has, and I'm, <laughs> and I'm jealous. <gasps> uh, is he Canadian? Uh, he is. I don't know. But yeah. they recently. So. Hang on, there was an article about this very recently where somebody just went down there and found garbage. Yeah. I just looked you, at that, like uh, plastic bags. Yeah, plastic bag. Yeah. Yeah. The deepest part of the ocean. Like right down was, there, like however. They're in the you bottom know how far it is? of the far world. down as you can go. And Six found, miles yeah. deep. And you know what? It's in bag. there. It's 36,000 feet. And the last thing is point six. It says on the side right here. Right here it is. Oh. I just saw it today. I'm like, how do they know that point six feet? Pretty <laughs> accurate for something so deep. Right. Yeah. Um, I had an idea actually after I read that article because they're down there, so digging around. I feel like you guys should go off the coast of Guam and drop like a guitar or something. Oh my god, that's so a like good when they idea. find it later, they're like, Where in the hell did this guitar come from? <laughs> yeah. It's kind of like sticking the flag out, on the moon. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Said, well, yeah. Where are you? not a hollow body, like, <laughs> not, a hollow not your favorite guitar, like, like a junker. One that, one that you know you're gonna put on eBay that's, anyway. Would that be so funny? But we'll sign it first. Yeah, like I feel like it's a good idea. I'm just saying. I wonder Not- how long it would take to go <laughs> all the way down. James yeah. Cameron's there with his fancy submarine. He's and filming it. The corner of the boat. <laughs> I'm sure yeah. it had to have some drift, so you'd have to have, hire like an oceanographer Ooh. to where do you put it in? Because with the currents, it's gonna it's gonna be floating for quite a while. Depends on the wave or drifting. Maybe. I don't know. I don't, I, I don't know either. I just thought it would be cool to drop a guitar in there. <laughs> so I came up with a game, okay, and it's called In the Trenches with Mariana. Oh. Yeah, and so it's just a few trivia things about Mariana's Trenches. Let's see if you guys know okay, what we yeah, do. Yeah, we like the band. Far away. Okay, so first question. <laughs> all right, these are just fun facts that we can all learn. If you don't know, I don't go back. Some of them are. What was the name of the survey ship that first investigated Mariana's Trench? I'm not going to know this one. <laughs> is it too hard to start with that? This is like really that an easy question. Is this, okay. is this the one that was in the, like, the, the, the first minnow. time they went down there? Yes. The what, Challenger Deep or something like that? Yeah. 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 Oh, what? Yeah. 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 Yeah
Good bass player. You know what? Your was that? Jeopardy last night. Now I was getting a lot of questions right at 2 a.m. when I couldn't sleep. <laughs> there you go. Know. Does anybody know what year that was? Like 60s or 70s? Mm. Listen, don't make it harder. <laughs> <laughs> well, that could be another question. Um, so we already talked about this, but let's just, how deep is it? Is it over 10,000? 36,000 feet. It's as go. deep as Everest is. Oh, like, like three times or something. No, that's why it's deeper. Everest, oh, is, Everest is probably what, 22,000 or 3,000 feet? Oh, okay. We better check our facts out here. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. All right, here's another one. Life was discovered down there, okay? Now, just which of these forms of life were discovered, these kinds of fishes, okay? <laughs> the dogfish, the catfish, the snailfish, or the swordfish? I think it would be the snailfish. Snailfish. Is yeah. What yeah. Winners! Yeah. I'm like, I know. Wow, we're going to. <laughs> Oh, we're doing way better than I thought we were going to do. Yeah, you guys like kicks butt. That's it. That's the game. Walk away. Amazing. Yeah, we should probably end on that note. It won't get any better. Um, Although, if I can ask you guys to do a couple of quick liners. Yeah. 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 That would be amazing. Wow, I did not even.